Yeah, hello everybody! Oh, I don't know when you're going to be seeing this. Uh, it's Friday. It's not Friday. This is Saturday. This is Saturday, but I don't know whenever you're going to be seeing this. Saturday morning. Not early morning, though. I'm running out to get medicine for the missus. I took her out yesterday to urgent care to get some... Uh, get checked out for her head pain in her ear ball one ear ball she's had it for a while and she had issues she thought she might have had an infection a bladder infection and they don't think that she has one but they gave her some they gave her some medicine for that too, just in case. Said that the medicine will more than likely take care of both. They are going for testing for they'll cover both. Come on. So I'm like, yeah, that'll cover. That'll work. So I'm gonna run down to the Walgreens where I dropped the script off for her yesterday. That way she'll have it. My girl, my girl, will have it for. Which I do have some some news. She won't, basically, what she she was waiting to see the doctor. For she go to the doctor's appointment, which I had. I seen went to that office and I complained about it last week. Complained? Yeah, I complained in that video. You could say that. It was a little bit of a rant video about people. Yeah. Uh, one was about how the, the one the, the the one insurance lady showed up at my doorstep when announced, and the other one was uh, about how. Basically, how I was treated at the doctor's office. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I got more on that one about the doctor's office. It's not. It's a, it, it, it is what it is, and I'll give. I'll give back to with it after. Afterwards, afterwards. There we go. Got you back on. Got you back on, there it is. Okay, now I got oil off my freaking foot. Stepped in a patch of oil, somebody was leaking out. I just hate that. Okay, we'll let you go ahead and I'll speak at you about what happened. Oh, blow, blow your horn, blow your horn, so we get you what happened. Well, okay. After the, uh, I got back from the doctor's appointment. It was like I could, uh, they, well, actually it was, it was that night evening. I got a, uh, I got a questionnaire it was sent to me via text see how I uh, if what the how I like the doctor's appointment and I gave it to him what happened okay but then <laughs> it was like two three days later I uh, got this warning first warning from the doctor about my behavior yeah my behavior for being loud. For being loud. Uh-huh. I'll tell you what. Suppose I yelled. I wasn't yelling. 
I was not yelling. And uh, I, uh, whenever I get emotional, I do get a little loud. I do, I do do that. But I'm not. I don't. I'm not going to hold somebody's hand and be their nursemaid because they can't, they can't handle it. No. Let them handle. Deal with it. That's the way I see it. But I kind of see it this way. I was, I was planning on uh, moving on anyway. Because I wasn't going to deal with the office that way. Anyway. That's just my... That was just me. And I mean, I... I, whenever I first seen him three, four years ago, I sat down and I had a discussion with him about having a situation like this. And I told him back then that I had a situation like this that I wasn't, I wasn't going to have it. I was not going to have one bed. I was, I would leave. I would go find another doctor because I would fire him. Because there's no firing me that, no, he's working for me. I'm not working for him. And I don't know what this uh, little, this little warning uh, thing is to go into this, uh, this record is. I mean, if I guess uh, it goes into this make-believe record, uh, I mean, I guess they can, they, they can let you go. And not be your doctor. Yeah, they could, They have the right to do that. But this permanent freaking record. I mean, not, come on. Back whenever you're a kid in the school, they used to try to scare you with this permanent record. Ooh, the permanent record. I didn't care back then. I mean, uh, come on. It didn't bother me back then. They ain't gonna bother me now. And that's just the way it is. I mean, I'm not gonna act. I ain't gonna be Mr. Tough or anything. But uh, no, no, no. He uh, the, the record should be is, is that uh, he works for me, and he's already been released. He's already gone. And that's the way it is. I don't I don't play games. not that deal. I don't deal with the people not young. I mean, I mean, that doctor, that, that that intern, I mean, he was, he had a, he had an anger control issue. I mean, he, my wife even thought he was going to pull back and wall up on me. I locked in, I was waiting for it. And chances are, you guys wouldn't have seen or heard anything because they would have made sure that my account would have been dead before I would have been able to post it. But yeah, that's just the way life is, chances are. But I mean, I'm not, no, I, I am not, I don't, I, I'm not going to play games with them. Just the way it is. Not playing Mr. Tough Guy? I'm not, no. But on the other hand, I'm not going to be sitting around taking it either, you know. Mike, you ain't sitting around, they're waiting for stuff to happen. Let's go down this alleyway. It's been a while, huh, goat? You need to see the alleyway a little bit. It's been a while. It's cooler in the alleyway, huh? But yeah, so I got this letter sitting, and I'm gonna, and yeah, I can write and respond to it. It's not worth my time. Nice wheels! It ain't worth my time. It ain't not worth my time one bit.
And I could tell him, I said, you need to pay attention to what your uh, people underneath you, because he's supposed to be head of that. But, well, it ain't worth it. It ain't worth it. Because he's going to protect his, he's, he's going to defend his, his babies, you know? His babies. <laughs> his babies. But no, it ain't worth it. The wife and I have decided we're going to just move on home. Move on. We've already decided. We have a doctor. We've a physician that we've already decided to interview. And see how well that works out. And we'll keep looking until we find somebody that works out. Because they work for us. We don't work for them. <laughs> oh boy. This is Muzzle Mike. Hoping you all have a great day. Signing out.